Hi everybody, this is Autumn Stoneflower. I am here today to talk a little bit about introducing your little ones to your pagan craft, whatever it may be. So, um, developmentally, kids tend to learn uh, through play and experimentation at a younger age. Um, one thing that you're going to want to do before letting them experiment is just take anything. See, my Thame, it has this guard on it so he can't hurt himself. You might want to take breakable things off of your altar. Um, but other than that, I don't think he'll break anything else. Hey, hon, can you send Fend up? All right, so um, in a minute, my son's gonna come up. He's uh, he he's just turned two. He's about two years and a month or so. Uh, now he's been already had a chance to experiment with my altar and my stuff, but this is just gonna give you an idea of what we do and just kind of have, help him familiarize himself with everything. All right, here he comes. <laughs> There you are. Come on. Hey, come here. Let's play. What have we got here? Come play. Hey, no, no touch. Don't touch the tablet. There we go. Okay, so we're moving. Okay, whoops. The lighter. Can you hand mommy the lighter? Thank you. Do you want mommy to light the candle or the sage? Yes. The candle. Okay, so you might not want to let your child play with fire, but mine's pretty chill about it. He loves pretend trying to blow out the flames. And eventually he'll get it. But again. Yay! <laughs> yay! But again, like I said, this is just play. It's experimenting. That, that is a candle. Can you say candle? Candle. Yes. So basically, we just let him play in his own way. Uh, you can tell we've played before because uh, we play blow out the candle. And we play oh, wave the sage around. Okay. The light. Light the sage. Light, light the sage. That's right, mommy blows on it. Let's try and get it. There you go. There. Is there not enough smoke? I need that. Oh, it went out by the time you got it. Jeez, child. Alright. Oh, that really is now. Okay. That really is burning my altar cloth. That's atypical. Yay! And here he is. He's just playing. He's watching the rising smoke. This morning, he smudged me and my husband. Just waved it around, all around us. Whee. So, but the things you do with your child don't necessarily have to do with lighting things on fire like mine. Um, no, no don't touch! Hot! Personally, I think it's a better way for him to learn hot to touch a warm sage stick than, you know, something that's actually going to burn him, burn him. Hello. Hello. Are you saying hello to the people watching? Hey. Come back over here. But things that you do don't always have to do with fire, like I was saying. I mean, he'll also pick up different things. Like, he picked up my Shiva statue this morning, and I said Shiva, and he tried to copy that. Um, I know this sounds odd, but he loves to sleep with 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 this rock um oh 
The other thing he loves to do is he loves to take the box and where is it? And open it up and take things out and put it back. So let's make sure the sage is really out because mommy actually did a good job of lighting the thing this time. Something else you could have them do. I've got this little salt thing so we can sprinkle salt. You want to try sprinkling salt? This is something he hasn't done before, so let's see. Yay! Sprinkle, sprinkle. And look, it's one of your favorites. It's water. Water. He's a Leo. He should have been a Cancer, and he loves, loves water of all types. Yes, you're a water baby. Now that you figure out there's water back there, uh, Oh, water and salt. Oh, you just made salt water. Yeah. See, this is the sort of things that you're, it's it's pretty unscripted. Yeah. But uh, you just really let them play and just make sure there isn't anything that's going to hurt them or break anything. So yeah. that is uh, episode one of introducing paganism to your small child. Yeah. So I hope you enjoyed. Oh, this. You want mommy to light it? Light. There you go. And you can blow it up. He loves to blow things out. <laughs> All right. Thanks, everybody. And uh, stay tuned for the next one.